Average Joe. Today is a visit to Disney's Boardwalk Resort. And we're here for dinner at Trattoria Al Fora, which is the northern Italian restaurant they have under the boardwalk, which was previously Spoodles in a past life. So we're gonna hop over there, we'll check out the menu, see what's going on, and uh, we'll catch up with you in a few minutes. Hang tight, folks. So here's your into the Boardwalk Resort. Since it is 100 and some degrees outside, they have free water as the good friend of the average Joe Rick decides to get a drink of the lime water and they have the regular water. I'll get a drink of the lime water as well. We'll get a review of the lime water here in a second. Let us know. Quite refreshing. Yeah. It's really unbelievable. Would you like me to give you some? Thank you. Complimentary as well. Oh, perfect. All right. Thanks, guys. We'll catch up with you. Cheers. Cheers. In a little bit. All right. So we made it to the Boardwalk Resort. We're just sitting out here, ready to walk over to Trattoria Al Forno, which is right there. To get some dinner. We're a little early. But we had to take bus transportation here and you never know what's going to happen and there's the yacht club and the beach club resorts and it's quiet it's a little after four o'clock on the boardwalk it's very very quiet on a saturday in august okay one of the first group of guests here in Totello corner just opened they snuck us in a few minutes early which was great it's very nice dark woods in here sorry about the white in the background there with the camera doesn't white balance very well and we have our menus uh, I'll go through and show you here. So you just read it. I'm not going to read it off, but I'll go through it. It's like an Italian restaurant. And I don't know what I'm going to order yet. I'm not sure. So we'll see. There you go. So you can always pause the screen if you want to read anything closer. But again, this is mid-August 2018 and this is the menu for Trattoria Al Forno at the Boardwalk. Okay, we'll be back in a few minutes with what we get. Alright, so we got our meals. So I have the classic chicken parm with cavatilli and Connor has the bolognese. It's a beef bolognese yep. over pasta and his is uh, dairy free. And Rick and our three here, Richard, will have the cavatilli with, can you describe what it is you got there? Cavatilli with uh, meatballs. Is it meatballs? Very good. Alright. Okay, so we just finished our meal over yeah. at Chattoria Al Forna at the boardwalk. Uh, I had the chicken parm. The boys in the middle here both had the uh, meatballs. So I got to say the chicken parm was very good with the cafeteria. I cannot complain. They said that the, they call it Sunday gravy or the, the sauce, the spaghetti sauce, had a little bit of a bite to it. It had a little bit of a bite, I would agree. Right. But I thought it was it was very good. So a chicken parm, I definitely recommend. What do you guys think about your meatballs meals? I thought they were, they were really good. They were the beef, pork, and veal. Uh, very well done. And um, yeah, the uh, Sunday gravy, a little bit of a kick, but uh, very good. It was good. And Connor, how was your, you had the braised short ribs, right? It was pretty good. Pretty decent. The bolognese. Bolognese. So good. All right, so I think we recommend the restaurant. We'd all say we would go back there, that's for yeah, sure. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, for sure. All right. Good stuff. Perfect. Perfect. All right, folks, thanks. Uh, this is The Average Joe. We'll catch you next time. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, share us on social media. We would appreciate it. Take care, folks. See you later.